and fun. Stay clear of the closing doors, please. You gotta love this channel. It's New York. That's right. Thank you, Charlie. Hello and welcome, homies. It is your pal, Alan the Homie. It is Friday, April 19th, 2024. Hello and welcome, Sally Scipio. Ricardo is also here. Marilyn Perlman is here. Hello and hello to Ronnie C. How you doing, guys? I welcome you. It is a cloudy but cool day here in Manhattan. I am here at Damroche Park at Lincoln Center, getting ready to go into the um this exhibit called the daedalum i hope i'm pronouncing it right i'm not sure if i'm pronouncing it right but anyway we're go we're gonna wait online now hello to brenda nelson saying hi alan from the hobby shop fantastic control well thank you brenda i appreciate that welcome everybody again we are at damroche park here at lincoln center and hello to karina thompson here in the mod squad hey and brett m is here hey brett how you doing everybody let me flip the camera around. There we go. So I'm at Damroche Park here at Lincoln Center. And we're going to get online right now. And again, this is a free exhibit. I don't know what it's about, but we're going to find out. We'll, we'll find out together. So Karina and Ricardo are here in the Mod Squad. Hello, guys. I'm sure we'll be joined by some other people already up to 19 people here in the chat. So again, welcome to everybody. And if you take a look, it's a bit cloudy here in Manhattan. Lisa! Hey, Lisa here is joining in the Mod Squad. Hello, Lisa. So while we're waiting online, I hope everybody's having a fantastic Friday. And I think my intro was a little bit off center. I'm going to have to fix that. Just have to adjust it for the next time. Now, tomorrow night, I think I may be heading to Queens for the Queens Night Market. Still up in the air, but I think I might be going. We'll see. So again, I hope everybody's doing well today. And you can see there is quite a line of people here. Hey, Gorge. Gorge saying, clouds make me sad. Oh, <laughs> Jeremy Wynn. Hey, Jeremy. I'm doing well today, Jeremy. I hope you're doing well. Hello to Jennifer H. Hi, Jennifer. <laughs> Please don't be sad, Gorge. We don't want anybody to be sad. I know clouds are kind of gloomy. I just adjusted the uh, just adjusted the uh, the camera lens hey Joe Hernandez is joining us hey Joe how you doing Jay Des? And guys, if you are new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe. 
Hey, Jack is here. And Jack just sent us a $4.99 super chat saying, always great when Alan is live with his wonderful mods and viewers. Thank you so much, Jack. You know what it's time for. It's not time for that. <laughs> just wanted to make sure you hit that like button. But it is time for how sweet it is. Thank you so much, Jack. $4.99 super chat. Thank you so much. How sweet it is. And an early Hershey's Kisses. How you doing, Jack? Hope you're doing well. Again, we are here at Lincoln Center. Damroche Park at Lincoln Center. Again, thank you so much, Jack. Hershey's Kisses. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Here we go. Hershey's Kisses. Wee. Hershey's Kisses. Round and round it goes. Where it stops, nobody knows. There it is. Okay, I didn't want to. I don't know why it keeps doing that, but all right, let me get rid of the Hershey's Kisses now. So the name of the exhibit is called The Architect of Airs Daedalum. Again, I hope I'm pronouncing that word correctly, Daedalum. Not quite sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but... Gorgeous allergic to Hershey's Kisses. <laughs> hey, Em! Emily here, Emily Gangadine joining us here in the Mod Squad. Hello, Emily. Oh my goodness. I don't see, oh yeah. I just realized that. I'm going to need to fix that. Give me a second. I'm going to go onto my other phone. Ricardo, I don't know what happened. Give me a second, Ricardo. I'm going to fix that right now. Okay, Ricardo, I believe it should be fixed now. Oh, yeah. Ricardo, let's see if the wrench came up. It should come up now. I think I fixed it. I don't know why that happened, but you should be good now. That's very strange. I don't know how that happened. No, I would never, I would never repo. I would never repo his wrench. There we go. Good as new. Good as new. I'm sorry about that, Ricardo. That was a simple fix. Awesome. Awesome. You're good to go now, Ricardo.
Absolutely, yes. Absolutely, he got it back. I know I'm not saying much right now, guys, but <laughs> I apologize. You know, you know me. I love to talk. <laughs> he his wrench in his trousers. And Dave in Bangor, Maine is joining us. Hello, Dave. They're, they look like they're all inflatables. And we're gonna be going through this whole big thing. hope that while we're in there that we'll have a good signal we should have a good signal and that big thing that you see right back that looks like a big clam shell that is the band shell here at Lincoln Center so again thank you so much to Jack for sending the $4.99 super chat I really appreciate that Jack said, <clears throat> I think you can walk through those inflatables as a sculpture. Uh, there was another live streamer that walked through. It looked really cool. Oh, awesome. Okay. If there are tickets that are required for this, I mean, I, it is a free event. So, 
So again, I don't know. Don't know if tickets are required, but uh, again, it's free. This is it. And hello to Patricia Johnson. Uh, Brenda is asking where I am. I am at Damroche Park here at Lincoln Center. You could see Lincoln Center in the background. Hello, Marty. How you doing, Marty? Okay, so it says Fast Track opening the Monday before the event at noon. Fast Track gives you access to the priority line until 5 p.m. Wait times may vary. Fast Track reservations for this event are no longer available. Okay. So you don't need tickets for this. But again, the, the fast track reservations are no longer available for today, or I don't know if it's just for today or for the rest of the event. The event goes until uh, the 21st, which is on Sunday. okay guys we'll just wait patiently no rush guys we're here to have a good time here for a very positive experience as always guys <laughs> can I use my press pass to jump the queue I wish I could hello Sharon L hi Sharon And by the way, Sharon L, your prize has been mailed. Please let me know when you get it. Hey, L is here. Hey, L. L, we are back at Lincoln Center again um, um, for the uh, Day Dalam. Again, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly. But it's a free event here at Lincoln Center. And what you do is you walk through these giant inflatables. Yes, yes, I can see. Cold sloth, yes, I can see it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. Yes, I can see it. I apologize. I'm sorry. I've been concentrating on, <laughs> on getting in, and I apologize.
<laughs> no gorge. I'm so glad Elle is here joining us today and everybody else here in my mod squad and everybody else here in the chat. Welcome to everybody. So glad you're all here spending part of your Friday afternoon with me. And Joss Dean. Hey, Joss. Yeah, I know that raising canes. I got to tell you something. Wasn't bad. Now, you know me about fast food, guys. You know, I'm, I'm not about going to fast food places but I gotta tell you something Raising Cane's was not bad the chicken was pretty good and that day actually my stomach wasn't feeling all that great um, and they, they say that if your stomach isn't well you shouldn't eat fried foods but I ate it slowly and it really wasn't bad I, I enjoyed it the chicken was really pretty good I mean I would go back there again And I think they just op they opened a Raising Cane's in Harlem also. But again, guys, you know me with fast food places. But yes, yeah, definitely L Raising Cane's was really good. It was really good. I'm glad we went that day. And I can't wait until you guys come back, L. And hello to Dolores. Say hi to mom for me, Elle. I know you're probably working right now. I only worked half a day today. I wanted to make sure to get over here. I promised everybody at the last live stream, the day that I went to uh, the Brooklyn Diner and had that gigantic hot dog. Oh my God, that hot dog was, I gotta tell you something. That was probably one of the best hot dogs I ever had. And the fact that they still had the, you know, the uh, the skin on the hot dog it was nice and crisp. Oh my God, that hot dog was amazing. Largest hot dog I've ever had. It was like the size of a giant sausage, like a kielbasa. Sally Scipio saying, I'm all about the chains. <laughs> I mean, look guys, you know, hey, everybody's entitled, you know. But if chain restaurants are going to be charging as much as regular restaurants, you know, that's that's a problem for me, guys. I'd rather just go to a mom and pop independently owned business and buy good food there. Definitely, L. I definitely hope to see both you and your mom. Hi, Dolores. Definitely good. You gotta have a little snap on your hot dog. Absolutely. That's why, even though I love dirty water hot dogs, um, and usually 99% of the time they're skinless hot dogs, but once in a while the casing on the hot dog, I mean, and when you throw it on a barbecue and you grill it, the skin gets nice and crisp. Oh, I love it. I love it. Just gotta have that crisp skin. Ron TV Metro is here. Hey, Ron. And yes, and Lisa, I ate it all exactly. Oh yes, homie loves a hot dog. You got that right, Lisa. So again, for those of you that are just joining us, we are here at Lincoln Center. Here on the west side of Manhattan, West 66th Street, where Broadway and Columbus intersect each other. Lisa's saying, didn't know there was such a thing as a crispy hot dog. It's, it's, it's not the fact that it's a crispy hot dog, it's just the fact that when, when they leave the casing on, the skin, it and you grill it, it becomes nice and crisp. Now, obviously there are some hot dogs that they sell without the skin on it. And when you put it into boiling water, obviously it's not gonna be crisp. Gorge saying I prefer hot dogs over cheeseburgers. I'll take a hot dog any day. Hot dog, oh. Love it, love it, love it. I mean, hey, guys, you know me. I love my dirty water hot dog. My Sabret dirty water. 
Yes, absolutely, Emily. Grilled hot dogs are yummy. And by the way, Emily, I saw that short that you did with Sammy. His birthday steak. Oh my God, the way he chomped down on that steak. And he was, he was licking that board clean. Hey, Darlene W. Hey, Darlene. Exactly, Marilyn. You definitely need that snap. Absolutely. Absolutely. Our dear friend Darlene W. is here. Hello, Darlene. Lisa's saying, I haven't had a hot dog in ages. Going to have to have one. Yes. Ron TV saying, with or without ketchup? Ah, strike. I don't put ketchup on a hot dog. Mustard only. Spicy mustard. Especially the sabret mustard. That's the best. The sabret mustard? Oh, the best. And if they don't have sabret, then I'll go for a spicy brown mustard like a Goulden's. But I will not put yellow mustard. No yellow mustard. Uh-uh. Nah. It's either sabret mustard or a spicy brown mustard. But I don't go for that yellow mustard. Ugh. Yeah. And of course, a nice, a nice potato knish. Also with mustard, of course. Darlene W. celebrates seven months of membership. Woohoo! Yes, Darlene W. Congratulations to Darlene W. Let's give her some Hershey's kisses. Congratulations to Darlene W. They go up and right back down. Seven months of membership. And hello, Leela. Let's give a round of applause. Seven months of membership. And Elle is back. Welcome back, Elle. Once again, hello to Leela. And hello to Katie. Katie, oh my goodness, here we go. Darlene W. did it again. Darlene W. just gifted 20 more memberships. Oh, God, Darlene, you are so awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello, Liberty Tree. Liberty Tree is joining us. So the following people were gifted memberships by Darlene W. Caitlin Bree, updated just now. Windtube, Stephanie Gray. Adriana was gifted, oh awesome. Helena59 was gifted. CGEM67 was gifted. Let's see who else. Brooklyn Bella 19 was gifted. Merck Caduceus was gifted. Patricia Cruz was gifted. Woohoo! Dolphin Bear was gifted. Let's see who else. 
Irma Westerback was gifted. Chicken Leg was gifted. Roy! Oh, this is awesome. Roy was gifted a membership. Jay Z was gifted. Ronnie C was gifted. Katie was gifted. David Bangor Maine was gifted. Oh, that's awesome. Blue Star was gifted. Frank McCloud. McCloud? Frank McCloud was gifted. Oh, Darlene, you are awesome. Thank you, Darlene. Hershey's Kisses. 20 Hershey's Kisses. A whole bunch of Hershey's Kisses. Thank you so much, Darlene. You are awesome. Oh, love you, love you. Thank you so much, Darlene. You are so amazing. Thank you so, so much. A big giant Hershey's kiss. Wait, let's give her, let's give her a real Hershey's kiss. What do you think it's going Let's see, give me a second, let me flip the camera. Now let's give her a real Hershey's kiss. There we go, there we go. Boom, a big Hershey's kiss. Hershey's kisses to Darlene W. Thank you so much. And Blue Star is here. Sending the blow kiss home emoji. Guys, you know, time for a little commercial break. Guys, if you do have access to membership to my channel, you have access now to my special home emojis. You will also have access to my monthly members only live streams. Now with Passover coming up on Monday evening, I am going to be doing, uh, I think I'm gonna be doing um, not a members only live stream. I'm gonna do a live stream. I'm gonna be showing you a, a doing a cooking demonstration. I'm gonna make chocolate and toffee covered matzah. Uh, I'm going to do it as a public live stream so that everybody can see it. Um, because, you know, I usually only do my members only live streams the last weekend of every month. Hey, Hala. Hala's here joining us. Hey, Hala. Quote <laughs> French's mustard kisses. <laughs> cool guy. Ricardo sending a whole bunch of Hershey's kisses home emojis. Thank you, Ricardo. Hello to the wizard. Hey, the wizard. How you doing? Yes, I am going to be doing a cooking stream. It's going to be a public live stream, so I'll do it for everybody. I'm going to show everybody how to make chocolate and toffee covered matzah. I'm going to make it from scratch. I'm going to make the toffee from scratch also. And by the way, guys, it's pronounced toffee, not toffee. We New Yorkers pronounce it toffee. Just like we say coffee. Coffee and toffee. Liberty Tree is asking, what are we in line for? We are in line uh, for an event. It's a free event called The Architect's Heirs to the Daedalum. And again, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. It's spelled D-A-E-D-U-L-U-M, Daedalum, or Daedalum, or I, I don't know. Anyway, and we're here at Lincoln Center, where the building that you're seeing right in front is the Metropolitan Opera, also called the Met. <laughs> Gorge said, for members only live stream he'll be reading tarot cards <laughs> I wish I had that kind of uh, ability I do not have that ability hey stylish bunny stylish bunny saying wow on so early Alan and El and hello to everyone hello to you too stylish bunny so this is the um, Metropolitan Opera that you're seeing right in front of me the Met and just to the right of the Met is the old Avery Fisher Hall, which is now called a David Geffen Hall. And of course, this building is the New York City Ballet.
Sally Skippy is saying, can't wait till the end of the month to go grocery shopping at Key Food. So in just a few moments, guys, we will be entering into the labyrinth. That's what they call this. This is the labyrinth, L-A-B-Y-R-Y-N-T-H, labyrinth. Liberty Tree saying, I want a raffle today. A basket filled with snacks. Oh, that's awesome, Liberty Tree. And again, tomorrow, uh, tomorrow night, I might, that's a big, big might, M-I-G-H-T, a big capital with capital letters, might be going to Queens for the Queens Night Market. Yes, Sally, I do see you. Yes, absolutely. Yes. <laughs> so I might be going to Queens for the Queens Night Market. We will see. Because I won't be able to go until after Passover ends because, again, I do keep the holiday. So, okay. So the line is starting to move. One. Okay, no problem. Am I gonna have a problem with my bag or? No, no, no. you oh. can either leave it out here if you want or you oh. can take it in with you. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Not a problem. Sally Scipio is saying, I can't wait until November and September. I can't wait till summer. <laughs> I just wanted to get warm already. Oh, so anyway, so Lisa was asking about my press pass, using the press pass earlier. Um, I don't think that would help me. Not for this. It's because, again, it's a free event and, you know, it's not it's not like um, a press event, you know. Oh, really? You take your shoes off? Oh, I didn't know that. Exactly, Darlene. I want heat. <laughs> I can't wait till summer. Lisa saying you take your shoes off once inside. Sally Skippy is saying I don't like summer, it's too hot. I mean, I, I like the cool weather. I don't like it very, very hot because then again, you know, doing live streams during the summertime, especially when it's humid, forget it. I sweat a lot. And you guys remember that from last summer. Um, but again, I just, I hate the cold, even though I'm a November baby, I just, I don't know, for some reason the cold and I just don't get along. <laughs> and Darlene W saying, yes, you do take your shoes off. Okay. I guess they have a place where you can keep them. No problem, Elle, no problem. <laughs> I know, right? I only worked a half a day today. <laughs> <laughs> That's 
Exactly, exactly, Ricardo. And the game will get hot. Yes, exactly. Yes, we are next to go in. Yes. One. Illinois takes his shoes off on his only oh God. I don't think so, Hala. Don't think so. And Gen 5? Hello, Gen 5. Oh, sure. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. I'm going to just put this down for two seconds. Okay. Okay, the shoes are coming off, guys. Okay, guys, remember where I put my shoes. <laughs> so I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> but they come in and it's like, no, you can't jump. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, they think it's a bouncy but castle. I, they do. They do. It's so hard. <laughs> I know it's so hard. Right. Okay. So you have about till four o'clock. By four o'clock, you should be on your way out here. And 
Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go, guys. Do I go to the left or the right? I think I'll go to the right. <laughs> they release the hounds if you're not out by four. <laughs> Daryl Janik is here. Hey, Daryl. Are we inside a spaceship? <laughs> kind of feels like it. <laughs> Stylish Bunny saying, what is this? It's Again, it's called the Daedalum. And basically what they said, it's basically like a kaleidoscope of natural light. And the different colors of light. Are formed from the natural light from outside. Saying it feels like we're inside a human body. Huh? Ready, 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 ready. Yes, we're now entering the esophagus. <laughs> Aliens will pop up soon, right? Hello to Nick Johnson. What's up, Nick? entering the stomach. <laughs> yeah, right? This would make a good twilight zone. No way out. through this way. Oh. 
dead end. There's no way out. Hope you guys aren't claustrophobic. Oh wow. Check this one out guys. Wow. No problem Emily. Emily's cleaning the house. This is really cool. Okay, <laughs> Ricardo saying I'm enjoying this. Thank you so much, Ricardo. Leela saying this is awesome. Isn't this great? This is really, really cool. Definitely worth the wait. Absolutely, Brett. Absolutely. Oh no, Emily saying it's snowing doggy here. Oh no. No, you doggy here. Definitely very cool. And hello to Jenny Lee. Hello, Jenny. Welcome. Jenny Lee saying we've come a long way. Yes. Welcome to Alan the Homie Food and Fun, Jenny Lee. Once again, guys. Make sure you smash that like button and if you are new to the channel, you know what to do. Hey Michelle Marie! Hey Michelle, how you doing? Glad you're here joining us. So we are inside the labyrinth. The architect's heir to the Daedalum. So cool. Don't you love the hypnotizing music, guys? Hello to Michelle. 
Michelle Norton. Hey, Michelle. This really is, it's, I'm telling you, it's cool. I hope you're leaving a trail of breadcrumbs. Thank you. You streaming on Twitch or YouTube? Was that um YouTube? Yeah. How was it in there? It was excellent. Nice. Excellent. I'm Thank glad. you. Okay, guys. Oh, that was it. And Brett M. just gifted to GZA 160 a membership. Thank you so much. Thank you, Brett. Let me grab my sneakers. Two more seconds. Put my sneakers on. And then we are going to thank Brett M. for the gifted membership. That was true. They were all ready to go. Okay. Thank you. Okay, guys. So, now we're going to thank Brett M. for gifting a membership. Oh, wait a second. He gifted, I think. Oh, my goodness. Brett M. gifted five memberships. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, Brett. Wait. Kim O was gifted a membership. Let me see who else. And TNR is saying hello from Cheshire, England. Hello. Who else was gifted a membership? Give me a second. GZA160. Pat Waters Vlogs was gifted. Carol Woods was gifted. Oh my goodness. She Clicks Bricks was gifted. And Kim O, thank you, Brett O. Brett, you are awesome. Thank you. How sweet it is. Brett gifted five memberships. Brett, thank you so much. Mwah. Hershey's kisses to you, Brett. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Brett. You are so awesome. Thank you, Brett. Darlene, thank you. And of course, earlier today, Jack sent a $4.99 super chat. Thank you so much to everybody. Hershey's kisses to all of you. How sweet it is. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Hershey's kisses. Let's give some Hershey's kisses. Hershey's kisses to Brett M. And of course, let's give him the real thing as well. Boom. There we go. Close up. Extreme close up. Hershey's kisses to Brett M. Wee, wee, wee. Thank you so much, Brett. You are so awesome. Oh, Brett M, Darlene W, Jack, oh, everybody. Thank you so, so much, guys. Everybody sending home emojis. L sent blowing the kiss home emoji. Karina sending the uh, how sweet it is, the New York City skyline, the woohoo, the virtual hug. Thank you so, so much. Oh, awesome, awesome. Okay, guys, so now what we'll do is we'll walk around Lincoln Center for a little bit. So, again, so that was the labyrinth, and it was very, very cool. Hello to Connie E. Hi, Connie.
And yeah, oh, I've heard of Duty Ron. As a matter of fact, Virginia has told me a lot about Duty Ron. And I've checked out a couple of his streams. Very, very interesting. Guys, if you're into um, the um, those, those crime, you know, uh, those crime things, I forget what they call it. But um, very interesting uh, what he does. So you should check out his channel. Uh, I know Virginia told me about it. Anyway, so this building is the Metropolitan Opera here at Lincoln Center. And of course, David Geffen Hall, which used to be called Avery Fisher Hall. That's the building that's right in the center of your screen. And I was telling you on the last live stream that I did when I was here last week that I used to go to Avery Fisher Hall for concerts when I was in high school because I was in the high school orchestra. So every month or every other month they used to have what they called the Young People's Concerts. They were concerts for young peoples. <laughs> and of course the fountain right here in front of, in the center of Lincoln Center. And the New York City Ballet. That's this building right here. walk around um, if I do wind up going to the uh, Queen's Night Market tomorrow yes I, I will live stream but then again I, I again guys I'm still not a hundred percent positive if I will be going tomorrow night so I'll, I'll definitely I'll see I'll see what the situation is for tomorrow. And this is the Paul Milstein Pool and Terrace. Why don't we check this out? This looks cool. Of course, just across the street is the very famous Juilliard. This is the Lincoln Center Theater, the Vivian Beaumont Theater. And we're gonna check this out over here, guys. This looks really cool. Big lawn over here with steps. This is really nice. Yes, it's a famous school. Yes, the Juilliard School. Absolutely. Why don't we check this out, guys? place to just sit and relax. Mm, I love the smell of the grass.
Is that real grass? Yes, it is. Yes, this is real grass. And I love the, the smell of the fresh. It smells like it was just mowed. But yes, this is real grass. Find a place to sit. There we go. <sighs> sit down on the grass. It's beautiful. And Michelle Norton's name Buster Rhymes went there, yes. Beautiful guys, just sit here and take it all in. And they were saying that we may get some rain here today, but just like a passing shot. I mean, you could, again, you could see how it's cloudy. Tiny little patches of blue, but for the most part, it is cloudy. Absolutely very relaxing area, Ricardo. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, definitely. Karina, this is a great place. Just sit, relax, put your headphones on, listen to some nice calming music. Hey, Damon Dunn is here. Hey, Damon. Or read a book. Absolutely. Just a great place. Just sit, relax. Absolutely. Sharon L saying, I almost attended Juilliard. Oh man, that would have been awesome. Michelle Norton saying, it's clear skies here in Tacoma. And even though it's cloudy here, it's always a beautiful day. Spending it with, with, with my homies. Hey, Segundo Ramos is here. Hello, Segundo. Hola, amigo. Te saludo desde Ecuador y siempre veo sus videos, amigo. Y muchas bendiciones. Okay, so uh, let me see if I can try and see what he says. He said, hello, friend. And salutations from Ecuador. I always watch your videos, my friend. And many blessings. Muchas ben Bendiciones is many blessings. So thank you, Segundo. Gracias, amigo. Gracias. Johnny Azaria. Hey, Johnny. How you doing? How you doing, Johnny? Everybody check out Johnny Azaria's channel. And of course, please check out Cool Guy's channel. Please check out um, <clears throat> Lisa UK Girl's channel. Um, please check out Nick Johnson's channel. So, and again, guys, if you do have your own channel, you're welcome to post it. All you have to do is just type in exclamation point and the word L-I-N-K. No space between the exclamation and the word link. It's just exclamation L-I-N-K. I'll show you how it's done. So guys, if you'd like to post your channel here in the chat, all you have to do is type in exclamation L-I-N-K. That's exclamation L-I-N-K. You know, the little exclamation point looks like an upside down I. <laughs> so exclamation L-I-N-K. Type that into the chat and your YouTube channel will automatically appear. Johnny wants to know if I'm going to the game tomorrow. Unfortunately, no, I can't go to the game tomorrow. I would have gone just to see them um, because again, tomorrow our, the, the wonderful radio announcer for the New York Yankees, John Sterling is retiring. He is officially retired from broadcasting for the New York Yankees radio network. John Sterling, of course, is famous 
Yankees win. The Yankees win. <laughs> Uh, John Sterling officially retiring from the New York Yankees radio broadcast. I wish I could be there tomorrow, but I'll watch it on TV. Uh, and again, I might be going to the Queens Night Market tomorrow. Uh, I'm still not sure if Danette and Anthony are going. Danette's back has been really uh, not feeling well. Of course, they did their live stream last night. Uh, their members only live stream. I hope those of you that are members of Danette and Anthony's channel, I hope you checked it out. Um, so, um, but I may be going again, may be going again. That's a big may uh, <laughs> uh, to the Queens Night Market uh, in Queens, Flushing Meadow, Corona Park. So we will see. We will see. Still not sure yet. Um, but unfortunately, I will not be able to go to the... Uh, Yankee game tomorrow afternoon. Unfortunately, again, I did want to see them retiring uh, John Sterling. And of course, John Sterling's fame, the very first famous home run call that he called was, of course, for Bernie Williams. Burn, baby, burn. And all of the famous calls that John Sterling has come up with for every single Yankee that have ever hit a home run. A-Rod, of course, was an A-bomb from A-Rod. So, but yeah, John Sterling, famous broadcaster for the New York Yankees Radio Network, retiring, officially retiring, and they are going to be doing a special uh, celebration for him tomorrow at the stadium. So again, unfortunately, and I know that it's also... Um, it's also Aaron Judge bobblehead. But I will tell you one thing. My nephew and I will definitely, definitely be going to bobblehead day on July 5th when they're going to be giving a uh, special bobblehead for um, George Costanza. It'll be George Costanza bobblehead day on July 5th. So my nephew and I are definitely, definitely going to that game. Definitely. So, but unfortunately... I can't make it to tomorrow's Yankee game. Michelle Marie saying Yankees number one always and forever. Absolutely. And again, congratulations to John Sterling. I know that Michael Kay was saying that he's going to miss John. Because Michael Kay, of course, the broadcaster for the Yes Network. Hello to Holly Sheet. Hi, Holly. And by the way, guys, uh, for those of you that have just joined us, I am going to be doing a special live stream. Uh, I'm going to show you how to make chocolate and toffee covered matzah. I'm going to be doing that. It's going to be a public live stream. It's going to be for everybody. I want everybody to see it. So I'm going to be making chocolate and toffee covered matzah for the Jewish holiday of Passover. And I want everybody to see that. Now, I've never made toffee before, guys. So... <laughs> And I know it's not difficult. All it is is just melting brown sugar into butter. But I got to make sure that I don't burn it. So that's that's the big thing. I got to make sure you do it over a low heat because in our apartment we have a gas stove. So got to make sure I do it the right way. So hopefully it'll come out good. Connie E saying that sounds great. I'm looking forward to Michelle Norton saying, mmm. <laughs> Michelle Marie saying, I'm jealous of all your Yankee coats. Oh, <laughs> these have accumulated over the years, guys. All my Yankee jackets have accumulated over the years. Holly Sheet saying, it was nice to catch you live. Well, thank you, Holly. I appreciate it. I appreciate it every time somebody joins us for my live. Holly Sheet saying, I hear the Naughty Chocolate Bear makes a chocolate bar. Interesting. Adriana is here. Hey, Adriana. So again, guys, if you would like to post your YouTube channel in the chat, you know what to do. You know what to do. Oh, <laughs> I love it. I love it, Holly. They play, sing, and eat the bars. I get it. For those of you that get it or don't get it, <laughs> you know that music is always associated you always associate the word bars with music 
So, got it. Very good. I love it. Thank you, Holly. That was really cool. I love that one. Please subscribe to Lisa UK Girls channel. Please subscribe to Cool Guys channel. They both posted their channels here in the chat. Thank you so much, guys. Oh, and thank you, Holly. It's my pleasure. It's always my pleasure, Holly. Always my pleasure. Ah, I'm just leaning back now. Hey everybody, just laying back on the grass. So comfortable. I could sit here forever, but I won't. <laughs> but it's very comfortable, love sitting on the grass. Oh, you're welcome, Lisa. Elf sending the blowing kiss and the Hershey's Kisses home emoji. And of course, again, everybody, please check out Johnny Azaria's channel. Please check out Joey BKLYN. Please check out Nick Johnson. Please check out Cool Guys channel. Please check out Lisa UK Girls channel. Check them out, guys. And of course, please follow me on Instagram as well. Oh, and please check out Christopher Dotson's channel. I did notice that Christopher did a uh, a short, or it wasn't really a short, it was about three minutes, but he did do a short stream earlier this morning. And I think he said that he was going to go to Staten Island Mall today. So check out Christopher Dotson's channel. Should start a barbecue here, right? <laughs> I wish I had a barbecue grill. Johnny Azaria is saying you should start a barbecue. Okay, so I think I'm going to get up now, if I can. Ah, I didn't want to get up. But we're going to move right along. And by the way, this is the Lori M. Tisch Illumination Lawn. restaurant this is. Hmm. I don't know if it's open. Let's see. It doesn't look like it's even open yet. Is the restaurant open or? Yeah, it's a four oh, four. oh, it's four. Oh, okay. Um, do they have a menu that I can look at or? Um, yeah, if you go inside and talk to the hostess there, she, oh. she has all the menus. Oh, okay. Probably very expensive, guys. After all, this is Lincoln Center, guys. I'm sure it's very expensive. We will walk through Lincoln Center. 
across the street is the Chamber Music Society. The Lincoln Ristorante. Okay, so the Lincoln Restaurante. Oh, and they do have a brunch here too. $48 for monkfish? Oh my goodness, wow. So again, here's Juilliard. And we are at 50 people. Hello to everybody. If you're just joining us or if you're sitting on the sidelines, guys, please come say hi. Don't be shy. We are here at Lincoln Center. And some spring and winter, well, winter's over. Spring concerts here at Lincoln Center. And this is the Chamber Music Society. back of David Geffen Hall and here we go guys here's a map of Lincoln Center so this is all number one and number two is all part of Juilliard one two and three the Walter Reed Theater David Geffen Hall, which is right here. I think it's Center Theater. Got the Met. The David Rubenstein Atrium. Tully Hall. different halls here at Lincoln Center.
Why didn't she just release it at all? And Emily's in Florida now. Oh, awesome, Em. So guys, did everybody enjoy the labyrinth? That special exhibit that we were just at earlier, if you just joined us and you missed it, you could always check it out on the replay. Right now I'm just deciding where I'm gonna go next. Virginia's here. Hi, Virginia. Hey. Virginia, did you just get here? We missed you earlier. Definitely. Okay. Yes. Oh, yeah. Definitely, Virginia. Jennifer H. saying it was great, Alan. Thank you. You're very welcome, Jennifer. Okay, so I am going to cross now. We are crossing between Columbus Avenue, Broadway. This is where Broadway intersects with Columbus Avenue. On the next block is WABC TV Channel 7. This is where Live with Kelly, and I forget her husband's name. <laughs> But this is where, before, before Regis passed away, this is where they did live, or they still do it. They still do live over here. Ah, uh, yeah, Kelly and Mark, I said. Live with Kelly and Mark. So this is WABC TV Channel 7.
And this is just one of the studios. And Frank McCloud is here. McCloud, how you doing, Frank? So I think I'm just gonna find a place to eat. Let's see, this is the Migrant Kitchen. Wonder what that is. I think I wanna find a place where I wanna sit. Elle's saying she just got off work, woo woo! Yes, awesome Elle. 57 people are here in the chat, guys. Welcome to everybody if you're just joining us. We are in the Lincoln Center area. Oh, and it looks like somebody posted the weather for Manhattan. 53 degrees right here in Manhattan. Oh, Stylish Bunny posted. Thank you, Stylish. It's great to see you too, Frank. Let me see what I missed. Michelle Marie wants to know what's for dinner. That's a good question, Michelle. That's a very good question. Yes, yeah, El said, yeah, Kelly and Mark. Yes, that's it. Live with Kelly and Mark. He used to be Regis. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, Virginia. Oh, my goodness. I missed her comments. Wait. Oh, I'm sorry. I missed it. Oh, darn it. I got to go back into the stream. Give me a second, guys. I'm going to go back in the chat. Yeah. Earlier, Virginia said, looks like a really nice day. It's, it's cloudy, but at least it's not cold. A little bit of a chill in the air. Oh, but I missed a lot of... Darlene W. said earlier, $40 for Orzo? Oh, my God. I don't think I would pay $40 for Orzo. Oh, okay. Virginia said Middle Eastern to Latin American food. They got it. And it looks like... Looks like uh, Ricardo posted the weather for Dayton. El saying, is that the Equinox gym across the street? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Holly, she's saying earlier, McLeod, MST3K. <laughs> yes, as a matter of fact, oh, I just subscribed to MST3K. So I love that. I, I, uh, I haven't seen it in years, but ever since um, Anthony and Danette started mentioning that, I had to subscribe to it. So I just subscribed to MST3K's YouTube uh, channel. And for those of you that don't know what MST3K is, Mystery Science Theater 3000. Very big on Comedy Central. 
so hysterical. And D. Michael, hey D. And hello to Ruben Q. Hello, Ruben. And hey, Christopher Dotson is here. Hello, Chris. I was just talking about you earlier today, Chris. We mentioned that you had done a three minute video earlier today and that you were going to Staten Island. Did you ever make it to Staten Island, Chris? M7 bus. Goes down to 14th Street. Just deciding where I want to go to eat. I have no idea where I want to go to eat, guys. And again, tomorrow, most likely, well, not most likely, most probably, still, still probably, gonna go to the Queen's Night Market tomorrow night. Again, it's not a definite, guys, so I don't want you to hold me to it. But. Might be going there tomorrow night. It's Queen's Night Market at Flushy Meadow Park. Again, right across the street is WABC TV, Channel 7, where they do live with Kelly and Mark. ABC Eyewitness News. Channel 7.
right guys just a quick just a quick mention don't forget to please hit that like button please subscribe and share it with the world Michelle Marie saying Chinese food sounds good, although Friday is pizza day. Chinese food does sound good. Chinese food does sound good. You know what? I'm wondering if I should take a trip down to Chinatown. Hmm. 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 Does that sound like a plan? Of course, if I do go downtown, I'll probably have to. I don't know, guys. I don't know what I want to do. I don't know what I want to do, guys. I am at 30% battery right now. I would have to plug in the battery pack. And we're at one hour and 43 minutes. There are 67 people here in the chat right now. Once again, hello to everybody. If you are just sitting on the sideline, come say hi. Don't be shy. We love you all, guys. You're all welcome here. We welcome everybody to Alan the Homie Food and Fun. <laughs> I am just deciding what I want to do. Okay. Karina Thompson saying yes, go to Chinatown. Still deciding, guys. Ricardo saying go to Chinatown. Everybody wants me to go to Chinatown. I think I think I'm gonna have to go to Chinatown, guys. Ooh, wow, look at this beautiful. Oh my goodness! Wait, guys, there's a brown. I've never seen a brown pigeon. Look at that. I have never seen a brown colored pigeon before. Wow. A brown pigeon, never saw that. Michelle Marine saying, yum, I'm hungry. I know, I am getting hungry. I am definitely getting hungry. And hello, hey, Kiana Marie is here. Hi, Kiana. Darlene W saying, time for me to head home. Darlene, thank you again so much for your gift of 20 memberships. Thank you, Darlene. Be safe going home. Wasn't that a pretty pigeon, Patricia? A pretty pigeon, Patricia. <laughs> Take care, Darlene. Thank you again. Be safe going home, Darlene. Now, if I do head down to Chinatown, guys, I would definitely have to take the train because I'm up in the 60s right now and Chinatown is all the way down, so I would definitely have to take the train downtown. So um, I would have to end the live stream. And then if I do go to, of course, you know where I wind up going if I go to Chinatown, guys. <laughs> of course, I'm going to go to Woe Hop. Um, we definitely thank you so much, Darlene. Darlene saying we need to grow this family. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Darlene. And of course, thank you to uh, Brett M for donating, for, for gifting five memberships as well. Thank you, Brett M. And also to Jack earlier. Jack sent us a $4.99 super chat. Thank you to Jack. So guys, you know what? I think I'll end the live stream here so I can plug the, the battery pack into the phone and charge it up. And this way, it'll give me some time to head down to Chinatown and we'll go to Wohop. Why not? Okay, guys. Now, you know, guys, you know that when we go to Wohop, if I go downstairs, there's no signal. So I'm going to have to see if I can get a table outside. So... <laughs> exactly. Christopher's, Christopher's saying, we know you're going to Wohop. <laughs> Holly, she's saying, thanks for a fun time. Oh, you're so welcome. Still 55 people here in the chat. And guys, you know that I hate ending a live stream where there's so many people in the chat. But again, it'll give me a chance to charge the phone up and get on the train. Now, the one train, the number one train is right here. So I can just hop on the number one. It's actually just right, literally right over here. Wait. 
literally right there right there so all I have to do is hop on the number one train take that right downtown and um, this way it'll give me a chance to charge the phone and so yeah everybody see yeah quick everyone leave <laughs> anyway uh, and then um, yeah when, once I get down to Chinatown I'll start I'll, I'll, I'll do part two of the live stream so guys uh, again I love you all guys I can't do this without you you know I say that every single time but it's true I cannot do this without all of you you guys make this channel happen I love you all so guys thank you all for joining me for part one and we'll get back with part two Jack saying great live today and Jack thank you thank you thank you thank you and of course guys we can't we can't forget about saying wait there we go give me a second here we go we can't forget about saying thank you to my awesome mod squad HC teacher that's Virginia and of course Lisa UK girl cool guy that's Ricardo Wolfgang Productions that's Luna Danette and Anthony Karina Thompson Desi Des Emily Gangadine L the original and of course caught you looking thank you all so much my mod squad is awesome give them a big 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 thumbs up guys for doing an awesome 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 job as always Brett I'm saying great live stream thank you so much Brett and again Brett thank you so much for gifting the five memberships you are awesome Hershey's kisses to you Hershey's kisses to everybody and guys as I always say this live stream is just about over and done make your life sweeter with food and fun if you're ever in need of anything to do always know that the homie will be there for you and life is full of a bunch of hits and misses and until next time which will be very very shortly i bid you adieu arrivederci buenas tardes and hasta luego until next time i bid you adieu and um <laughs> with lots of love and Hershey's Kisses. I didn't mean to extend that because it's part of the rhyme, guys. The rhyme is actually life is full of a bunch of hits and misses. And until next time, lots of love and Hershey's Kisses. Love you all. Emily sending puppy kisses. Johnny Azaria saying Alan. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, guys. And um, I will see you again in just a little while. As soon as I get to Chinatown, we'll start part two of the live stream. And uh, hopefully I can get a place outside to eat at Wohop because, of course, downstairs there is no signal. So I'm going to have to make sure I get an upstairs seat at Wohop. Okay, guys, love you. And we will see you all very, very soon. Adieu, adieu to you and you. Thank you, Darlene. Okay, love you all. Be well, be safe. And I know I will be well and be safe as well. And we'll see you in a little bit. Thank you, Virginia. See you later. And we'll see you all later. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm, Hershey's kisses to everybody. Love you guys. See you in a bit. Bye. Let me, oh, I got to get my outro ready. God, I'm so, you know, huh, I'm, I'm unprepared. That's what it is. Let's get that outro ready to go. Okay, here we go, guys. Thank you. I'll see you in a little bit, guys.